Okay guys, today I will be doing a case review for the E4 City iPod Touch 5 case in green color. I mean 4, iPod Touch 4. Okay, so right here we have the iPod Touch. You know, just the normal iPod Touch 4. Not the 5 and it's 32 gigs. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you a review of this um, case that I got. It's called the E4 City Hybrid Case. And it's in three parts, so it is a little bit protective. And it has these things right here to cover up those, but it is not waterproof, and there is no screen cover. See? Okay. So first, I'm going to show you how to assemble it. So first, you'll take the iPod like this, and you'll put it, see, like, right here, you'll put it in here. So you can see how it would cover the front. Then you take the back piece, and you slide it in like this. And you have to clip down all these little things all around it, if you can hear it. Okay, so you can see how the iPod fits in here, but you can't really reach any of the buttons at all because this part, that's where this part comes in. So you're going to slide it in, and you're going to put this around the edges of the case, and you can see you have to put it all, like all these things, you have to push them in like that. And there's some more right here, gotta do that. And then there you go. And this is pretty much the case, like right here. As you can see, there's a hole for the camera, and I'm pretty sure that's a microphone. There's a hole for the camera on the back, and then there's a hole for the Apple thing, which just looks cool. And then right here, you pull this, you just push this out and put your headphones in. This will just lean against it. And to charge it, you just push this out and put your charger in. And there's a hole for the speaker right here. And the home button is actually kind of sensitive, though, so it works really well. And then... When you can, you can see right here we have the volume buttons. Let me test them out really quick. Can't let you see. Okay, so let me like load up my iPod. And as you can see, look the volume buttons. See, they work pretty well. And the power button works really well. So this is pretty much the E4 CD case. And this is the case that I use for most of my reviews when I use the iPod 4. But in some earlier videos, I'll be using the iPod 5, which is in the next videos. I'll do a review of that, too. And it's currently what I'm recording with because it has a great quality camera. So that's all for this video. So I guess see you guys next time on The Gaming Reviewer 101. Bye.